On a global scale, the number of vape users rose from about 7 million in 2011 to 41 million in 2018, creating one of the world's worst endemics to date. Even worse, during the COVID-19 pandemic, the number of global vape users rose to 68 million people in 2020. The CDC's vaping statistics for 2019 and 2020 show that 2,807 people in the U.S. were hospitalized due to vape-related lung injuries. However, how does this affect our community? Vapes or e-cigarettes have become extremely normalized and popular during recent years. According to the CDC, nearly one in five high school students were using e-cigarettes in 2020. Now, I'm sure many of us can agree that the COVID-19 pandemic has taken a toll on the mental health of people on a global scale. The pandemic has raised feelings such as depression, anxiety, and severe stress. According to an August Truth Initiative survey, four in five young people who had vaped said nicotine started to lessen these feelings of stress, anxiety, or depression in 2021. Additional data from the survey shows that young people turned to nicotine as a coping mechanism. In order to combat the pressing issues of nicotine abuse, dependence, and addiction, we introduce to you the anti-vaping addiction system, Avas. Not only does Avas neurologically help counteract the chemical effects addiction has on the brain, but it also ensures to help treat the patient's general state of being in an aerosol drug form. This product will contain cartridges named APODs, consisting of the chemical formula we develop that enters the body. The formula for these APODs will include nicotine inhibitors, corticosteroids, antibiotics, and heliox to create a comprehensive drug that will be easy to administer. The delivery system will consist of a capillary tube, PLA body with pressure plates, and a PLA mask that will be used to direct medication, which will be biodegradable materials that is cost efficient. The final price on the market will be $37.38 for bupropion, $38.64 for Varclean, and $37.94 for the dual medication. All prices previously listed are projected numbers that will last a span of 14 days and will have 42 concentrated dosages. We want to note that before these cartridges can be used, all chemicals in our formula will be natural and potentially FDA approved. Avas's main goal is to not completely reverse the effects of vaping, but instead to try and slow down the harsh damage of nicotine and to slowly plateau the growth of dopamine reliance. Little by little, Avas will begin to reverse the process, and while not all the damage can be healed, addiction can be thwarted at an early age and vaping can be deterred. Avas utilizes two main ways of tackling effects of vaping and healing the body. The first will be addressing neurotransmitter health in the brain, and the second will be lung tissue growth from vaping damage. In the case of dopamine, once dopamine is induced, a feeling of pleasure and reward will spread throughout the body and cause a moment of relief and happiness. However, when dopamine connects to receptors and begins to be absorbed, the receptor sends signals through nerve cells that begin the effect known as addiction. Avas implements inhibitors to stop dopamine from attaching to receptors while still providing medication to induce the production of dopamine, effectively creating the feeling while stopping further dependency. Additionally, the steroids and antibiotics used in the formula will help heal lung tissue in the body and add an extra layer of protection. Corticosteroids will be used mainly to reduce inflammation while strengthening the lung muscle to aid with breathing, breathing discomfort. Antibiotics, however, will be used to help add an extra layer of protection against harmful pathogens to provide the lungs with a better chance to rest, rest and focus its resources on cell proliferation. The research behind Avas mainly stemmed from our lingering question, how exactly can we create an aerosol alternative containing both respiratory and addiction medication that will decrease the dependency on drugs while healing the damaged lung tissue, in specific nicotine? So what makes Avas so special and so important compared to these other devices? On the pharmaceutical market, current advancements in drug therapy do not take into account the psychological state or well physical well-being of the patient. Avas ensures to slowly reverse the neurological and several chemical effects nicotine has on the body based on the patient's customization and well-being overall. Additionally, aerosol treatments are crucial as aerosol devices deliver drugs rapidly and directly into the airways, allowing extreme local drug concentrations while limiting systematic toxicity. There is an extreme lack of this simple delivery system when dealing with current drug therapies and treatments. An estimated 8.1 million people in the U.S. vape on the regular and are considered to be regular addicts of nicotine. With this, we see that NRTs, which are our main competitor and supplier of anti-vaping medication, is projected to make $3.92 billion by 2028. Following this revenue model, Avas would be able to make, on a low estimate, $846 million annually. With Avas, the, the cure is just a breath away.